Hi, my name is Ivana Katz and I'm working on the Climate Ambition to Accountability project under the Youth Climate Champions program. We are here at the Youth Climate Champions boot camp at Cradle Moon in Mulder's Drift in Johannesburg. And we're here with 35 delegates from all over the country, from Kebeja, from Pumalanga, from KZN, from PE, and all over Gauteng as well. We're here to learn about climate change and capacitate young people to be able to engage in climate policy processes. Day one kicked off in the afternoon with a session on climate careers, how we can become change makers in the field, and with a focus on scarce jobs in the industry. Followed by a session on environmental career speed dating. We had careers from environmental law to circular economy and various other talks around water conservation, GIS, plastic policy and many more. My favorite part definitely had to be the career session. I think um, when they told us about careers in environmental change and stuff like that and the potential for earning because people are not that willing to talk about money <laughs> so when they were telling us this is the earning potential and stuff like that because we all want to make bag so yeah that was very interesting on day two we had climate 101 we had a co-learning session where we challenged where our assumptions about things like climate justice the just transition adaption and mitigation all come from literally climate change is here in South Africa, we have experienced it recently, for example, the KZN floods. But then apart from that, we are also experiencing heat waves currently in October. Help avoid and mitigate climate change because it's going to affect us and the future generations as well. On day three, we hosted a couple of guests. We had the Presidential Climate Commission come to tell us about the just transition. We had Irfan Mangera from the Ahmed Kadrada Foundation doing a session on climate activism. And then we had Alex Kogel from WWF doing a session on how to use social media for social good. Things are very hectic at the Central Conference Center. Good to fossil fuels. We are people from communities. Hi, so we're here at a local mine. Uh, we're here to protest the extraction of coal. Day four started with a session uh, where we looked at how mining activities across Africa affect ver its various communities. And then we spent the afternoon spoiling our delegates a bit where we got to explore the property and its natural wonder on a ferry in the lake here. And then we rounded off day five with a session which we like to call Next Steps, where we came together and tried to strategize a way forward with all that we've learned over the course of the week. A week like this would not have been possible without our fantastic sponsors, the Open Society Foundation South Africa, the South African Resource Watch, and the Ubuntu Hub, as well as Woolworths for sponsoring all of our snacks for the week. My message to people is that we need to take accountability and responsibility. Our volatile acts like reducing, reusing, recycle, it will really have um, a positive impact. Being socially aware of things that are happening, obviously climate change is there, it's a reality. So we need to react and respond accordingly to that. All of us from the Climate Ambition to Accountability Project would like to thank each and every one of you for joining us on this journey. And we hope to be working with you all in the future. 